evening all of you good evening everybody good evening children see your thumbs up good evening all of you good evening I'm not seeing from everybody, no? Everybody is listening? Are you all listening? Okay, this is Dr. Subhashri doing her eighth session of analytical reasoning. We have been uh, discussing about uh, various uh, uh, combination of letters, how, what will come next. How are the combinations formed? How do we make sense out of each of the uh, characters in the sentence? How do we map them? We also had some words mapping. Uh, we wanted to find out whether there is a relationship between the two words and that there are similar uh, ones in the options, choices given. So these were some of the exercises we did. We also had some uh, images. Uh, images combinations the series of images what will come in the next image how to identify the shapes and uh, the combination of the shapes how they are uh, clubbed together how how they are mapped together all these were our earlier sessions uh, we discussed in the earlier session now let us uh, discuss uh, very important shape which we all use in mathematics how many of you like mathematics? Do you like maths? Very good. Harini likes maths. Anybody else who likes mathematics? Children? Anybody who likes mathematics? I like mathematics. I love mathematics. So, because I love mathematics, I love teaching mathematics. Today we will see the shapes. Uh, can you tell me which part of the mathematics uses shapes? Which part of mathematics? Which branch of mathematics? Yes. Which branch of mathematics? branch of mathematics uses shapes quick quick you don't know if you know thumbs up if you don't know thumbs down insulation very good excellent very good dimensions all this we do yes geometry very good geometry very good and we also, how many of you know what is a Venn diagram? What is a Venn diagram? If you know Venn diagram, you can just say thumbs up. If you don't know, thumbs up. A union B, A union B, union C, A intersection B. Remember this now? Uh, there is A, this is called as A. And I have another circle called B. I am now considering this as B. What is this? Which is inside? What is this called? Now you are a trigonometry. Very good. 
so now what is this area called this red highlighted area how do we call this how do we call this union union is all together union if i remove this what is this a union b a intersection b excellent very good shrinivasan excellent and tyagarajan very good it's ex it is niveda you are right and if i have to have a union b this is what harini and others are saying harini is saying sir union vishnu vaidisharan is saying this union so union is together how do we how do we call a union b a union b how do we call this either a or b or both this is the formula rule when you say a union b either a meaning i will take another color okay green this green this is only a and i will take this color now this is only b this blue is only b this green is only a and this red is both a and b that's what this says either a that is this green color or b that is this blue color or both which is nothing but red color so a union b is equal to either a or b or both this green is just a there is no link with b at all whatever comes in this will be only a and whatever is within this b this blue color will be only b and this color red is a union b which is part of both a and b that's what a union b is either a or b or both understood what is a union b now i want to check what is a intersection do i do intersection i will do right a is b i want to do intersection in between what i will do is i will write like this do you see this intersection here okay. now tell me what is a intersection b a intersection b is this red color red color is nothing but it is both a and b all the items which will be part of this will be both a and b so which is equal to both a and b this is how you have to derive the formula in your in your coding when you when you work on some programs you will need to do all these formulas on your own sometimes you will be uh, you will need to know the formula as well i am a, i have a savings bank account uh, for example in a bank i have a savings bank account i also have taken the mutual fund from this bank from the same bank meaning i have my account is savings account union account union mutual fund so my account balance 
will always show both the okay now we are going to see some aptitude test with respect to the venn diagrams using the venn diagram you will also get such questions in your aptitude test okay agreed so far what is a union b intersection you understood give a thumbs up give a thumbs up please very good anybody uh, when when i show the question if you want to speak in the class you can raise your hand i will allow you to speak okay if somebody is interested in discussing fine i will go go to the first question see there are some diagrams here you are required to choose from the five diagrams the one that best illustrates the relationship among the three given classes in the question that follow so the question is criminals pickpocketers terrorists i will go back here i am going to draw criminals or this then i will i will draw pickpocketers then i want to buy, i want to draw what who is terrorist terrorist or dangerous right so i will use some other color now i have three diagrams here three circles here this is pickpocketers this is criminals and these are terrorists very dangerous people now they have drawn some pictures here for example pickpocket pickpocketers are also criminals if i feel that then i will push this into this now pickpocketers are also can also be criminals this violet is pickpocketer red is criminal they are terrorists so they have three circles here each one represent one of the three criminal pickpocketer and terrorist we need to find out which of this is best suiting i can ask somebody to talk can somebody volunteer you want to volunteer to raise your hand i will allow you to speak who wants to speak you can raise your hand okay okay i will just explain now the first one is criminals pickpocketers and terrorists you see both pickpocketers and terrorists fall and fall under the class of criminal pickpocketer is a criminal and terrorist uh, also is a criminal both are criminals now you see this and sometimes it's a possible it is possible that pickpocketers can also be terrorists all are criminals this is criminal the outer layer is ultimately everybody is a criminal now i will draw this afresh now we have all the three here we have we have to find out how to draw this picture everybody is a criminal terrorist is a criminal pickpocketer is a criminal criminal is a criminal now i am the the super set is the criminal criminal is in this color for us 
terminal is in this color. There is a possibility that some pickpocketers are also terrorists. Pickpocketers can also be terrorists. Terrorists also can be pickpocketers. Many times, all the terrorists, what will they do is, they will loot the money and jewels from the trespassers. They will be working for some uh, terrorist, uh, terrorist organizations. Who will feed them if they are terrorists? Only if they work, go for work, proper work, they will get paid. If they are terrorists, nobody will pay them, right? So what they will do? They will loot the trespassers. So pickpocketers can be terrorists. Terrorists can be pickpocketers. That is a A, union B. They are pickpocketers and they are terrorists. They can be and both. So we can consider this also for that. We can consider this also. This also for that. So I can consider this is a pickpocketer, this is a terrorist. Terrorists can also be pickpocketers. So the they are pure terrorists, pure pickpocketer, they can also be pickpocketer and Terrorist. So, this is the right answer. That's how this is derived. E is derived. Understood? Understood? How this Venn diagram is defined, you will get such questions in your entrance examination for your for getting into IT industry. All of you understood? Can I see? More thumbs up, please. Can you see more thumbs up? Very few only. I want to see more. All, or at least from all. Are you all listening? Okay, I will repeat. Vishnu Vaiteshwaran wants me to repeat. I will repeat it again. There are some Venn diagrams given and there are some situations given here. They are asking us to map this with one of the diagrams given. They want us to map these questions to one of the um, diagrams here. Criminals, pickpocketers and terrorists. I want to know the qualities of each one. I have a criminal. I There is a criminal block and there is a terrorist block and there is, there are pickpocketers. I want to map these three into one of the options given. Now I want to find out the relations between all the three. I know pickpocketer is a criminal. I want to write something like this. These are criminals when they are terrorists, these are pickpocketers. According to our understanding, all of them are terror, all of them are criminals. So I am blocking everybody as criminal. So one criminal. This is a this is a criminal. Okay, this is a criminal. Now I want to know terror. I want to know how to park these two inside this criminal because they are all criminals only. Till this, you understood Vaiteshwaran, Vishnu Vaiteshwaran. Till this, you understood.
Yes or no? Okay. Tell this you understood. Very good. Now, I I have criminal. Now, how will I place these two? I know everybody is a criminal. Now, I have a big, this brown one no, is very big for me now. This guy will occupy. Uh, I have to map these two into this somehow. How will I map the pickpocket as a terrorist inside this? Some terrorists are also pickpocketers. Some pickpocketers are also terrorists. Why do we say terrorists are pickpocketers? Terrorists for their food and other things, they will pickpocket from gen general public. So, the, some pickpocketers are also terrorists, meaning there is a combination like this. I will draw once again because it is just confusing. I want terrorist color is violent. Red. Some pickpocketers are also terrorists. Some pickpocketers are also terrorists. Some terrorists are also pickpocketers. A union B here. This combination is clearly some pickpocketers are also terrorists. Either A or B or both. So some pickpocketers are strict pickpocketers. Some terrorists are only terrorists, but some pickpocketers are also terrorists is the union here. So, A, union B or both. Now, I have placed this criminal as a bigger umbrella. The, all are criminals, according to me, all are criminals. Now, I also know that pickpocketers and there is a combination here. I am bringing this inside this. Now I am trying to map this with the option given, which is nothing but E. Dog, friendly animals, cat. Dogs, friendly animals, cat. Dogs and cats are friendly animals. Sometimes, if somebody hits a dog on the street, it will go wild and bite everybody, bite the trespasser, the general public. If somebody throws a stone on the <coughs> dog in the street, dog will become wild. Street cats also like that. If you Trouble the cats, cats also will become wild. They will also bite you. So, both are friendly animals. They are also animals. So, both dogs and cats can be wild as well as friendly. There are three here. Dogs, cats, they are friendly animals. Dogs and cats are friendly animals only. Now, I am bringing dog into friendly animal. Now, I will bring cat also into a friendly animal. Sometimes, when they are disturbed, they become wild. They are not friendly. So, now I have mapped this. Like this. Mapped it like this. Do I have one like this? Yes. This D is. D will match dog, friendly animals and the cats. Any doubt? 
வை விஷ்ணு வைத்தீஸ்வரன் எனி டவுட் ஆன் திஸ் சூர்யா நிவேதிதா ஹவு டு ஐடென்டிஃபை த பேட்டர்ன் ஆஃப் தி வென் டயக்ராம் this is very simple one whatever we are going to see next is very uh, very difficult one if you understand this basic it will be easier to solve the remaining i am giving you the basics of venn diagram now understood can we go ahead thumbs up thumbs up from all of you please Lias Khan you want to speak very good so all of you understood good now we will move to the third one food third spoons i want to map this food third and spoon now i will go back here third is a food i have food i have food here i have i have food here i have curd here and i have spoon here is Oh, curd not a food. Can you tell me is curd a food or not? Can we consider curd as our food? Curd is food, correct? Yes, curd is food, correct. Good. So, now we will go back here. What is this? This is the food. உள்ள போட்டலாமா கார்டு தொக்கின் போய் உள்ள போடுறேன் இது ஈஸியா இருக்கும் இந்த ஏ இது எடுத்துட்டு போறது விஷ்ணு வைத்தீஸ்வர் very good so it is not food it is not food it is neither food nor curd so this will stay outside apo how will my the look this food i am bringing inside food this is curd and i have spoon here i am keeping it outside i want to find out is there any diagram which maps to this do i have here do i have here what is that number can you tell me the number what is that number t somebody is saying c c c very good very good you are all very attentive who all agrees to see show your thumbs up thumbs up for agreeing to see very good i am not getting so many thumbs up right so i will go back here the answer is 
थ्री वेरी गुड एक्सलेंट नाउ दिस वन इज लिटिल सो आई हैव दिस वायर मीन्स गवर्नमेंट एम्प्लॉई then there is a triangle urban employee this is government employee this triangle is urban employee circle is graduates rectangle is teachers here i want to take this to i want to copy this into my paint brush now with this they they have some questions for us which of the following statement is true all urbans are graduates i want to know what is urban triangle is urban graduates is circle draw this let me try to draw this i am trying to draw a square here but i can color and show you i want a circle and i want to draw a rectangle so i have replicated this now i am going to see this all urbans are graduates urban who is urban triangle is urban i want to color this urban first this urban all urbans are graduates which is graduate circle so some urbans are not graduates people sitting here are not graduates those who come within the triangle only are urban people and those are this people are not coming inside this one so this is false all urbans are graduates abina na இந்த சர்க்கிள் ஃபுல்லா அவங்க வந்து ஃபில் ஆயிருக்கணும் சர்க்கிள் ஃபில் ஆகல when we did when we try to identify the urban people here which is nothing but this one and i have this triangle filled with urban people அவங்க graduates அப்படின graduateன்ற இந்த சர்க்கிள் should be lying within this urban it is not so the first one is false all graduates are urban same now i have to do now i will fill this now i have the original diagram now now the second statement is all graduates are urban so i am going to fill all graduates because he is saying all graduates are urbans have i correctly marked have i marked it correctly 
can you tell me yeah we are we are going to check that uh, albert raja yes i have marked it correctly all graduates are urbans no this is not filled completely when i filled all the graduates so the second statement is also wrong third all the urban government employees are graduates all the urban government employees now again i will go back here this urban all urban government employees are graduates i want to see urban and government employees this is government and this is urban so all urban government employees are here are they all graduates no so let us see the fourth one i think abdul raja has already found out all teachers are urban people teachers are here all teachers are urban people they come within the rank this is how you have to map you this is how you have to come to a conclusion you have to draw when when the questions are asked you should have rough sheet to check all this quickly you have to check you will not have so much time you will quickly check that understood this problem did you understand this problem d is correct srinivasan is right nivedita is right fine so we will move on to the next we are going to use the same venn diagram and check this statement there are some urban teachers for government employees as well as graduates we want to see first urban teachers urban teachers are here or we have already marked it for the last one and government employees are for some urban teachers who are government employees urban teachers are part of this government employees the square yes government employees as well as graduates as well as graduates is this some urban teachers are government employees as well as graduates because they come within this circle so this is correct they come within this square and this is correct yes no teacher is a government employee it's wrong because the government employees are here already all graduates are government employees no all graduates are not government employees all government employees are urban people no because this is not government so the first statement there are some urban teachers who are government employees as well as graduates all non urban teachers are government employees all non urban teachers i want to see urban non urban teachers they are urban correct this is this is urban government employee this is government employee okay non urban non urban no teachers see non urban teachers all teachers are urban only so non urban there is no meaning of it no teacher belong to non urban non urban means it should be outside of this triangle so no teachers 
belong to the outside category so this is wrong all urban government employees are teachers all urban government employees urban and government or teachers correct huh? can you tell me which one is right here i want one of you to tell me what is the right answer yes i want you to tell me which is right i can mark this put it into that also i will bring it here now tell me it is right all urban government employees or graduates urban government employees i'm going to fill this is urban government employees wrong this d is wrong i try to map all urban government employees here this is government employee this is urban so i want to mark them are they are all graduates no people belonging here are not graduates so d is wrong there are some non urban graduates who are neither teachers nor government employees no i'm bringing it again so a is wrong and d is wrong now you have to find either it is b or c all urban government employees urban government employees urban government urban and government urban and government urban and government urban and government or teachers this is wrong so non urban graduates who are neither teachers nor government there are some non urban candidates who are non urban this is only non urban and this is only non urban i'm trying to fill the third one there are some non urban graduates who are neither teachers nor government employees correct they are not teachers and they are not government employees neither teachers nor government employees meaning they are not teachers they are not government employees yes this is government employee and teacher so they are not government employees correct fine agreed okay very good any doubt on this next one you are going to do i am not going to do i will show you and you will do it confident you only need to find out just try filling it you you can have a pencil and paper with you just try to map and then do it agreed understood all of you can i have thumbs up from all of you want more thumbs up please so we will continue with this session i think it's already uh, 6:45 we will continue with the session
in tomorrow's class we have just seen two examples and uh, next the teacher is already there dr kritika and uh, over to you kritika we will meet tomorrow with us uh, with the next set of uh, venn diagrams and how to map them to the question and find a solution for that thanks thank you thanks all of you thank you